Welcome back to my channel. Sorry for the delay in getting these videos out. Lockdown, my day job has killed my time and uh, dark nights and winter weather just seems to have destroyed my enthusiasm to get out and on the van. If I had a workshop and it was stored somewhere nice and dry, then I could probably come out here and work on it at night. But anyway, that's the excuses over. Let's get into what we're actually gonna do in this video. So not the most exciting video out of all my videos that I've done, but we're gonna sort the toilet out. Uh, the video that will follow this will be the table. I'll get this table built, I keep saying it, and I said it in my like what we've learned video. I want to get the table done, get the toilet done, get the back done, get the worktop done. So all those things will happen over the next couple of weeks. Then there'll be one or two trips in between. So yeah, <laughs> you have to excuse this. This was not intentional. I did an Instagram picture before I did this video, like my merch some of the merch. I've started like making these B Jam van cushions and stuff. Uh mugs. Anyone can make mugs. And then another cushion. There is t shirts and hoodies and all sorts of stuff gonna be coming out in the next couple of weeks. So I'm just sort of seeing how it goes. But I quite like these. Yeah. It's good. Sweet. Anyway, let's get into this. This what we're gonna do is get the toilet and remember we said oh hang on a minute, hang on. I'll 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 do this properly. Right, here we are the toilet's under here, and do you remember in my uh, what we learnt video, we said about we can't actually access the lever to open the shithole, <laughs> for one better word, the hole. So what we need to do is look at how we're going to do that. So let's, let's talk through it. Right, what we're going to do is, obviously, the shithole in there, we said about this before, the lever to access it is down here, so you can't actually get to it. So every time we use it, you have to actually lift it out and put it on the floor down here, which is a bit of a pain in the ass, obviously. So what I'm gonna do is two things, really, to fix this. I'm gonna, obviously I've got about 60, 70 mil here to play with on this flap, so I've got some more of this 10 mil MDF. So I'm gonna take this off, um, yeah, remove this, I'm gonna, Cut another line about, I don't know, I have to work this out, probably centre between top and bottom, centre here somewhere, right the way along, cut a new bit, a new flap, if you like, and then so that'll open up and then be right close to the floor down here. I'm hoping, this is filthy, this man, I'm hoping that that'll give me a bit of bit more room. It won't actually be enough yet to allow me to access the lever, which is a bit of a pain in the ass, but that's fine. And then next job, I've got about, I don't know, 100 mil ish between the top of the toilet and sort of the top of the bench here so i'll work out once i'm on the sleeve i'll work out how much more height i need and then we'll just block this up i don't know we'll do something down there we'll block it up to hopefully sort the issue i really need to get this done first because i think i know most of you will know this already if you watch my videos but the plan is to make this into another bed area. So obviously I'm into my mountain biking. So this will create another bed for someone else to sleep. So it almost becomes a three or four berth van. Um, how I'm doing that is the back cushions here, which go on the back wall there and there, will be able to sit into the middle here. And then the table will lower down and that'll be another bed area. So this was just a temporary thing I did. So what I need, why I need to do this now is because I'm gonna screw a bit of batten and paint it in across the top here to sort of finish both sides of this. And then what will happen is um, the table, obviously on this adjustable leg, will, will sort of flip over and then lower down onto this area and that'll make my bed. So this is what I'm hoping to do in the next couple of weeks. So in this video, we'll get the toilet done. Probably not the most interesting video, but it needs to be done. And I filmed everything else in this build, so I might as well film this. And then the next video, we'll make this table. Not quite sure how to do that yet. What I want to do is, I think I sort of just said, is have like one smaller table here and then have another bit that sort of flips over onto here to make it a big table for when I've got guests <laughs> in the van and then lower it down. So if anyone's got any ideas how to do that, you know, I need to, this is, I need to come up with something under here. I don't know. I don't know. If anyone's got any ideas of how to do that, then just leave leave them in the comments below and I'll get back to them because I'm not a carpenter. I made most of this van myself or not an arm of it myself. So just having a go. But any ideas on that would be much appreciated. So yeah, let's get on with this toilet fix, shall we?
three quarters there now. So you just watch me. Well, you just watch it all. I don't need to explain it, do I? But it actually works good now, which is great. Um, I don't know if I need to explain all this because you've seen it, but made this up now. So I just need to give it a lick of paint. That'll plonk on the front there again, paint it all in, and that'll flap down like it did. But yeah, be right on it, be fine. It's tight to the top, loads better. I should have done this in the bloody first place. All I need to do, what I'm going to do now, and if you notice, but it's like getting dark outside. I can't feel my toes because I've been walking through the grass my, uh, and it's bloody freezing. So I'm just going to fill these holes with some filler, obviously. Fill these holes along here and then call it a day today. And then tomorrow I'll give it a lick of paint and then put it together and then we'll finish this video with a finished product. So yeah, better get on with some painting or some filling. See you in a bit or tomorrow when it's all finished. Right, smashed it. It kind of does look exactly the same as it did before, but it is now fixed and actually now works a treat. So I think I said this earlier, but it's a different day now. The lever now pulls out fine. It's level the top. So the, uh, that sits on there like that, which is perfect. So it clears it. So yeah, good job. If I might say so myself. Um, yeah, looks good. Uh, I have a little confession. Let me, uh, let me, let me tell you about this because it's not actually quite finished. So I gave it a couple of coats of paint and I went to put the lid on the paint tin back on after my second coat. And, uh, I used my foot and it's a plastic lid on the, uh, the Wix pewter paint tin. So naturally my foot went straight through it and I got a lot of paint all over my nice new set of vans, which is highly frustrating. If I'd have got that on film, it would have been awesome, but I didn't. So I've had to fit it regardless, and I'll just touch up later on. So you can see the top of this look is all white, and it just it could just do with another coat, but it's fine, it works. So yeah, as I said, you can see along here, and it just it just needs another coat, but it's good, it's good, it works, and it's pucker. So let's get this back together quickly so it looks like a van again. And we're back, looking like a van. Isn't she beautiful? So I guess that concludes my really exciting toilet repair video. Um, while I was editing this video, or actually editing the first part of this video, my subscriber count clicked over to a thousand, which for me personally is a massive achievement in the channel, in, just in, in this whole thing. I've been doing videos for seven months now on this van and it's a huge, huge milestone for me. So thank you to every single person that's subscribed. If you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button now. The videos will and are genuinely much more exciting than me repairing the toilet. It's just me keeping on the theme of the van and making sure that I film everything that I do in the van. So there will be adventures and there will be loads more to come. And as I said earlier, I've been working on merch so that you'll see a load of t-shirts, you'll see me wearing B Jam van stuff. This isn't B Jam van stuff. But over the next few weeks, as my samples and the merch turns up, you'll see loads more B Jam van t-shirts, hoodies, masks, cushions, cups, stickers. It'll all it'll all be available soon. So keep an eye out for that. So yeah, just trying to make something of it really, you know. Like my my time lapse video has got 40,000 views or something now, which is absolutely ridiculous. So I've really enjoyed doing it and I want to try and make something out of it as I've been saying all along because eventually I want to do it as a living so I'll keep trying. So thanks for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it even though it was a toilet video and wasn't that exciting. They will get more excited. Just make sure you hit that like button and make sure you subscribe. Thanks for watching.